News in 60 is supported by El Pato Fresh Mexican Restaurants. DHS Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas was in the Valley while here he laid out part of his plan if and when Title 42 comes to an end and we see more migrants come to the border. He says resources along the border need to be increased. That includes hiring more employees, more medical resources and transportation. His plan also includes helping nonprofits that work with migrants. Santa Rosa ISD is proposing a four day school week. They say they're doing this in hopes of attracting more teachers to the district. As the proposal stands right now, students would have the fifth day off, but teachers would use it as a teacher work day. Right now, there is no timeline on when this might be approved. The FDA has cleared a new over-the-counter COVID test, and it's unlike any other. It's called Pixel, and it was created by the company LabCorp. Using a nasal swab sample, it can actually test for COVID, the flu, and RSV. It can be bought online or at pharmacies without a prescription. And we'll see another warm and windy afternoon across the valley. Highs will reach the mid-90s. That's your News in 60. Have a great day. News in 60 is supported by El Pato Fresh Mexican Restaurants.